What's up, y'all? Just doing a follow-up video. Part two, if you will. Because the last one got too long. Slowing down my computer. Making editing like penance. I'm waiting for the new IMAX to drop. Later this year, rumor has it. They're skipping the M2 chips for the M3. Because I need some more gigabytes. Hopefully I have enough silver coins to melt to feed the beast system at any rate of speed let me feed y'all some meat the milk is out there in abundance you know what i'm saying stop playing management system they make us dump it and no matter how we stand up from this time i'm going public i want the people to see the pain that our growers have oh, by the way only one country in the world here in canada there's not, a, not the United States, not Europe, where they dump thousands of liters when they're over. But we're not supposed to talk about this. So he wants this to go public. Obviously, it's going to outrage people. It's ridiculous that as dairy prices go up by 2.2%, just the other day, February 1st, they went up 2.2% on top of 2.5% last September, on top of 8.4% in February 2022, we're having farmers dump supply and it's not just share so the, the last video i told y'all how jesus was rejected by the pharisees because when jesus stepped on the scene healing everyone the pharisees were petrified of losing their jobs the code in the hood is don't chop custies on a next man's block breaking that law could be the death penalty as it was for jesus not before Jesus gave them his judgment in Luke 19, 44. And they shall lay thee even with the ground, and thy children within thee. And they shall not leave in thee one stone left upon another, because thou knewest not the time of thy visitation. I'm sure y'all are aware, like 40 years later, 70 AD, the Romans burned the temple, and because it had gold on it, it was taken apart stone by stone to extract the gold. Fulfilling what Jesus said, not one stone will be left upon another. But that's not what we're here for. Notice the last part. Because thou knewest not the time of thy visitation. Notice, Jesus held the Pharisees accountable for not knowing Daniel's 70 weeks prophecy. They must have been lost like the prosperity preachers of today. We are without excuse today because everyone has the net. Are you waiting for his second coming? Can you discern the signs of the times? If not, chances are you'll miss the train back home. It's a return ticket. You come back after seven years to a destroyed earth. Why was it destroyed? Glad you asked. 2 Thessalonians 2.3 tells us, For the mystery of iniquity does already work. Only he who now let it will let, until he be taken out the way. Question. Who withholds wickedness on the earth right now? Jesus said in John 16.7, Nevertheless, I tell you the truth. It is expedient for you that I go away. For if I go not away, the Comforter will not come unto you. But if I depart, I will send him. Notice, it seems like one of the members of the Trinity has to be on the earth at any given time. Second, the Comforter is one of many metaphors for the Holy Spirit. That's why I was saying, you can't understand the word without knowing the code. This is why there's no chapter on salvation or judgment, because it's spread throughout the book. Why didn't the Holy Spirit put topics in their own chapters? Because God knew hostile rulers would put the Bible together. So if the Bible is going against, for example, paying taxes, the Vatican could just rip that chapter up. 
but because it's spread out here a little, there a little, like it says in Isaiah 28:10, so we only lose a little resolution instead of a whole topic. You dig? Now back to the tip I was on. Did they really have a choice? Before we play the blame game, we should check ourselves, you know? Let's not be hypocrites, we big people now. I, for one, think the whole thing was a front. How did I get there? Let's just do the math. God created everything in six days and supposedly rested on the seventh, right? Second Peter 3, 8. But beloved, be not ignorant of this one thing, that one day is with the Lord as a thousand years and a thousand years as one day along with 42 other verses so it's only fitting if God would follow the program let us continue our noise for 6,000 years then drop the millennial kingdom on us representing the day God supposedly rested because God can't be chill for one second because God sustains the universe actually Jesus it says sustains the universe Colossians 1:17 which is a heavy job, by the way, at all the evolutionists. In the beginning, there was nothing, then nothing exploded. And would you believe I got oceanfront property in Arizona? Check what people sell you. Look, it's all coming from the father of lies, Satan himself. And what's crazy is, he's the same one who's gonna accuse us on Judgment Day for believing his lies. Revelation 12 10. That's pretty slick. First, make people believe you don't exist, then point the finger at them for not catching the flicks. And that's why he hates the Christians who expose his lies. He's fine with those who just wear the cross and keep it to themselves. Remember, he's just buying time. If he can keep the Gentiles busy with the grind and the vanities the world has to offer, or if Satan can kill all the Jews, he can thwart God's promise to Abraham. So today, Islam and the UN is the tool Satan's using against little Israel. With an extensive list of 140 resolutions criticizing Israel. Before it was Hitler and many more came. Notice Satan just won't stop. Jewish people say, never again. The Holocaust took one out of every three Jewish people. Zechariah 13, 8 says the next one will take out two out of every three Jewish people in the seven year tribulation period. And it shall come to pass that in all the land, saith the Lord, two parts therein shall be cut off and die, but the third part shall be left therein. And this is referring to Armageddon the last battle on earth where Satan gets the whole world to attack little Israel. Then Israel catches the flex and finally calls on Jesus and Jesus comes back and saves the one third that are left. Then Hosea 5.15 will be fulfilled. I will go and return to my place. Notice this is God saying he's gonna go return to his place which is heaven till they acknowledge their offense and seek my face in their affliction they will seek me early what is the offense that they need to acknowledge that is obviously the rejection it continues on by the way this is what Jesus is waiting for Israel to say come let us return unto the Lord for he hath torn, and he will heal us. He has smitten, and he will bind us up. After two days, he will revive us. In the third day, he will rise us up, and we shall live in his sight. Remember, a day is like a thousand years, and vice versa to God, because he's outside of time. At any rate, notice, after two days, he will revive us. This is talking about 1948, the day Israel was reborn, 
and in the third day he will raise us up and we shall live in his sight. So it's been 2,000 years since Jesus came, which means the third day is about to start. This was written about 785 BC. So basically Jesus prophesied 785 years before he was born that he would get rejected. See, that's why I said it looks like a front to me. See, before I thought life was like a movie. But now I see it more like a video game. Because we have to have choice to do good or evil. Because God's judging us with hellfire or eternal darkness at the end of the day. Hypothetically, in a game, the stage you can't pick. That's where you live, for example. But you can't pick what you choose to do in that day, in that stage. And whatever you choose to do, God already knows what you will do. So chew on that. Oh, hell nah. This fool done set up shop again. You know what Method Man said. The hard-headed never learn. Oh shit, he's got a hostage. What's up with all this smoke? Where's Greta Thunberg at? And the climate change people. Lacking. That ain't me today. I'm putting out work. What's up, demon possessor? Oh God. See you back on the grind. Have you come for me? Is it my time? I don't see any pigs around. The ball, it tells me you are dead. Well, I guess that's the problem right there. Because I'm right here, alive and well. Why don't you rub my ball head and pick my brain and see what kind of prophecies you can come up with. You must leave. Leave, I'm not ready yet. Go, go! Make me. I ain't going nowhere till I get this work done. Besides, your sign said welcome Excuse 9 me. to 5. Didn't anybody tell you? This area's off limits. Relax yourself, Legion. Dude, you're deceived. I couldn't have Can't made myself see? more clear. When you go this to people area like this, is restricted. You open the door for possession. Then the demons you allowed in hey. will try to kill you hey, 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 before hey, you land the truth in life. Enough, Look, this fortune teller only knows about you because of the Turn demon you killed him. He's telling him all about you. But he can't tell you, you about here? the future. Only God can. Yeah. Stop or I'll shoot. Damn, I'm slowing down. Must be the age thing. Yo, this ain't no Michael Jackson thing. What? But you better start to sing. Where the money at? What? Wrong answer. What's up, tough guy? Talk shit now. My guy. That's all I think. There's people like you why the earth is so cold. Especially the leaders. Give me a reason not to point blank you. The paper's gotta be here somewhere. Probably in one of these lanterns. Shit, nosy ass neighbor recognized game. Dang, could have shot him up with the real silencer. I wonder if there's a spirit attached to this. Not safe. Have y'all noticed <laughs> most of the games, the movies, and TV shows are mostly about some vampire or Satan? All down to the half times. Are they trying to normalize it or something? How about this? 28 girls hospitalized after playing with Ouija boards at their school in Columbia. <laughs> hey, you remember it, don't you? <laughs> the girls had signs of an anxiety attack. The school's apparently waiting for a diagnosis before providing further information here. But it is worth noting that one mom said her kids always have a good breakfast and the fainting was not due to a lack of food. This isn't the first time this has happened in a Colombian school. Back in November, 11 teenagers collapsed after using a Ouija board at another school in Colombia. It was later reported that at least five of them had suffered from food poisoning. There, no. I would tell you. Maybe just don't use Ouija boards. I, yeah, I agree with that. That's what I vote Those for. Those things do creep me out. The ghost and all that paranormal stuff. Have you ever stuff. used one, though? I, you